cow's milk has estrogen in it. Human breast milk has no estrogen in it. Well, I had a tumor in my breast. That led to the other cancer discovery. But why did I have a tumor in my breast? It is our love affair with the cow. Because not only is that milk loaded with calcium and fat and other useless things. Oh, did I say calcium was useless? Yeah, I did. But it's loaded with estrogen. Every female on the earth produces estrogen. Now, fortunately, Father designed the human mother and the goat with a very efficient memorial filter or barrier. So in mother's milk and in goat's milk, you can find essentially no estrogen. But in every other animal or mammal's milk, I should say the larger mammals, estrogen is passed through into the milk. Now, you and I are not designed as men in the human, homo sapien, is that who we are? We're not designed to have estrogen in our body. We don't have the plumbing for it. Problem is, is when you dump estrogen into our body, our bodies become confused. They don't know what to do. In some cases, we try to develop breast tissue. And in other cases, we have a little strange thing happen down below and we end up with prostate problems. Or we may have that estrogen hit this gray matter that's packaged up in this, this globe here that in my case is empty, but not in your cases. When estrogen hits this area up here, we have some other things happen. Excuse me? If men have estrogen in their brain, they begin to believe or think or have uh, confusions, so to speak, towards womanhood. Now you guys are probably saying, yeah, but I drank milk like my whole life and I, and, and I ain't gay. But Utah produces along this Wasatch Front, produces more homosexual men per capita than any place on the earth. Why is that? We have a love affair with milk. Now, there's another problem though, and it's not, this, is, this, this covers women. We have the highest rates of breast cancer in women on the entire planet. We have the highest rates of cervical and uterine and ovarian cancers in women on the planet. What do you think is the cause behind that? It's that same product. So these young ladies' bodies, our children's bodies, our infants' bodies, and our fetal children's bodies with estrogen from the very beginning because you mothers are drinking milk and then you're feeding it to your children as soon as they get away from the breast. By the way, I hope you don't mind me talking plain because we're talking biology here. <clears throat> so we have women that have problems. We have young men and young girls having problems because of our ingestion of, of dairy products and animal products. I was led into that particular area where I was trying to develop breast tissue and I had no breast tissue to develop. So I developed a fatty mass. That fatty mass became a very hardened, uncomfortable piece of tissue, useless. And every time I drank milk, it began to try to change in size. <clears throat> and ultimately, it became a pain. So what is the solution? Not milk. 